Thank you, Presiding Officer. New figures show that 11 people have died and 69 have been seriously injured in accidents on the A96 in the last four years. The Scottish Government promised in 2011 that it would be duelled by 2030, but that is now subject to a review at a cost of £5 million and whose publication has been delayed by over a year. So, First Minister, when will this review finally be published and will this Government ever duel this killer road? First Minister. What, uh, of course, doesn't help when it comes to our capital infrastructure projects is a 10 per cent cut to our capital budget over the next five years. So what Conservative members can't do is come to this chamber, demand we continue to invest in roads, but simultaneously cut our budget time and time and time uh, again. So as confirmed Let's through hear our programme for government, we remain absolutely committed to improving the A96, including duelling Inverness to Nairn and the Nairn Bypass which already has ministerial consent following that public local inquiry. The Minister for Transport is due, uh, I believe, uh, is due to meet, I know, with uh, uh, members uh, uh, that have an interest in the A96 uh, on the 25th uh, of January. We'll provide a more detailed update on the scheme, along with details about how the review uh, is being undertaken on the wider A96 corridor. However, in the interim, let me absolutely assure uh, all members that preparation uh, work continues at pace on the Inverness uh, to Nairn, including Nairn bypass section, and I can advise that I expect orders for the scheme that will be made that will be made in the first quarter of 2024, with a view to completing the necessary statutory process. And the